So today we have the Genius Invocation TCG gameplay trailer. It just dropped just now. Uh, we saw a little bit of it in the 3.3 live stream, but I assume this is going to show us a bit more than what we saw before. So let's check it out. Oh, is it actually in the cat's tail? No way. After two years, we finally get to go into the cat's tail. Is that Xavier in the back? Sucrose of all people? Oz. I wonder what Diona has to do with like the cat's tail. Or sorry, the TCG game. Like, why is it here? Ooh. Wait, is it gonna look like this? Wait. Oh, I see. Welcome to the cat's tail. Ah, <laughs> what a nice surprise. Now tell me you came to learn Genius Invocation TCG without bringing any cards. I love it Diana. Time to see what you are made of. Oh shoot. With sword comes shadow. Oh. Go and play. So it works like elements. Mangu can't. Oh no. Oh, I, I hope that's exactly how it looks when you play it. That looks pretty cool, man. Let's go back. Let's go back though. The, the cards actually had like elemental reactions as well, which they did explain that before, but it looks like it did a lot of damage though. Like <laughs> you probably only have so many life points. So for, for it to hit that hard, yeah, you have 10 life points looks like. You start with 10, you gotta take out the whole team. But yeah, it looked like Mangu Kenki like absolutely just wrecked the entire, the entire team. Because Guoba, Oz, and the Animal Crystal Fly, Diona Fischel, Barbara. Yeah, she did sit an ult and took out like hell from all of them. She did as well. Yeah, there's Elemental Reactions, Ganyu, Sucrose. And there's the Prince. There's a Mirror Maiden card. But look at this. Oh, okay, it was just one. Either way, uh, looks really cool, honestly. I, I'm not really too into card games myself, to say the least, but I will give this a shot and try it out, of course, and see what it's all about. But hope you guys are excited about it, if anybody's into card games as well. Um, but yeah, it looks pretty cool. No, no, nothing really much else to say about it. I like the animations they have for it, um, and I'm glad it's gonna be like a new permanent mode, so. This will always be there, and I'm probably most excited to see that the cat's tail is actually open now, after, like I said, two years of it just kind of being talked about, but now we can actually go inside of it. So, hopefully that happens for the Wong Shong Funeral Parlor next. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Fingers crossed. But, yeah. That'll do it for me. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys are excited for the game coming soon in 3.3 as a whole. And good luck on the polls going forward. And I will catch you guys in the next one.